All new at six, a woman's recovering after getting attacked by a coyote in Fall River. She was with her dog at the time when the coyote bit her in the legs. WBZ's Paul Burton spoke to neighbors who jumped in to help out. She kept yelling, help, help, and the dog was yelping. That's all you heard was harsh screaming. A coyote attack in Fall River sends a woman trying to protect her dog to the hospital after she was bitten multiple times. Amy Rosendi says she heard the woman scream for help. I was screaming and yelping, and all you heard was the dog. It was trying to protect the owner. Police say it happened just after 5.30 Monday morning at the South Winds apartment complex. The woman was taking her dog for a walk near this wooded area when she was attacked. The coyote bit the woman's legs and arm. She was brought to Rhode Island Hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. She protected her dog, and she's in surgery. She had a lot of bites. While police were responding to the call, they learned the coyote had tried to attack some of the grounds crew at the nearby Fall River Country Club. They were able to fight off the coyote until officers arrived and put the animal down. Unfortunately, as a result of the aggressive nature of the coyote, the decision was made to ultimately put the animal down to prevent the risk of further attacks. Residents that live in this complex say they hear the coyotes every night, and after this recent attack, they're very concerned about their safety and their pets. It's definitely nerve-wracking. I used to take my dog laid out at night, and now we don't want to anymore just because we're afraid of getting attacked. Wow. Just like that uh, the neighbor did. So as soon as we heard that, we agreed not to go out late at night just because it's not safe. People with dogs, people that are coming back and forth at night or very early in the morning uh, need to be careful. Police say the coyote will be tested for rabies. In Fall River, I'm Paul Burton, WBZ News.